Audio Jungle. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Paylab News, the first edition. We are broadcasting live from Indiana Mansi from Boston University. Today is March 31st, Thursday, 2016. My name is Tevalo Sinem from Delta Autism National School, Maung Butuak. And I'm Leroy Shonga from a small country in southern Africa called Swazi. And I'm Sam Kelozwagala from Kimberley, the city of diamonds, all the way from South Africa. We have been in the United States, more specifically Washington, D.C. for four days. And we have only been in Mansi, Indiana for about 12 hours. We would like to share some of our experiences so far, things that we have learned, observed and compared with our home country. Tell me, Mr. Lever, what your experience has been like in Washington DC? First of all, Sam, before I tell you that, I am actually an adult mentor, which means that I'm a teacher of traveling with students, okay? So we are from a very small country in Swaziland. Coming into USA and coming into Washington meant a lot to us because it's a lot of cultural differences and a lot of things that we actually have to observe. So coming to the academic part of it, um, we actually engaged in sessions with the pain lifters, with the pain lift organizing team, and it was a very, very fantastic opportunity. For me as an educator, I learned a lot in terms of presentation, in terms of organizing the material and engaging the learners. I had so much to learn as an academic person. What do you have to say? Well, Washington DC was a fun place. We were in Mexico, that was nice. We went for sightseeing and I also got a chance to know my fellow Paylapos who happened to be the first cohort of 2016 where countries such as Zimbabwe, Botswana, South Africa, Zambia, Zambia and Swaziland. Okay, now I'm looking forward to months because yesterday I got to meet my family. That was nice. They were, what do you think? Oh, I met my family too. I met Joe and Shannon Bryant from the Bryant family. I met my older brother Luke and my younger sister Sydney. My older brother Luke plays football for his high school and Sydney plays, she does dance and she's into theatre. Mr. Joe is a physics physics teacher at the Boston University. Ms. Shannon is at the art gallery. And I played FIFA and I got to, I got to learn how to play FIFA with my older brother. Um, we had devil eggs, told me how to make devil eggs, which is I think it's an American type of food or something, but I hadn't ate back in Africa. I'm hosted by a very, very hospitable gentleman called Steve Roberts. Steve is actually a, a, a repair guy. He's got a small business where he repairs people's homes. But not only that, he's also a musician. Steve plays in three bands. He likes his music very much. Okay? I engage so much with this guy, um, especially on political subjects. Okay? I, I'm actually, I, I actually enjoy the fact that he is Democrat and the fact that he is liberal. So we engaged a lot talking about politics, talking about the elections, talking about um, everything there is to talk about in the, in the political front. So he helped me put into perspective what is going on in America right now. So I am hosted by Paul and his wife and two dogs, Mark and Kenny. Those are two wonderful dogs. And yesterday we ate super. That was the most awesome soup I ever ate. It was so tasty. It even reminded me of home, but not I'm enjoying Mansi and I think I'm gonna have more fun since we're spending a lot. We're spending two weeks here and it's been 12 hours already. I'm looking forward to the other hours and the program. So from beautiful minds, we'd like to say goodbye and we sign out.